Hi right guys, Tuesday the 14th of June. Just going for a quick tunnel update. As you can see, all my potatoes are producing lots of flowers. This one especially. And I've um, added a bit more wood chip mulch down there just to layer it up. Once potatoes are done, I'll probably get some more compost, maybe some manure bring it all up so it's one consistent level these are just growing and growing and growing and they're still I guess they're still being attacked somewhere along the line but they're looking quite healthy some of the onions are being a bit swamped so I don't know how well they're coped These first early seem to be lagging behind. That's the only one with some flowers on it. No, just have to wait and see. I've left them up a little bit today, just with some wood chips, just to give them some a bit more shade from the light, so they can perhaps produce a few more. But don't really know. Seems to be plenty of grasses in here. Plenty of um, fungal growth, so I'm quite happy with that. And there's a little mushroom up here somewhere. I, think I may have buried him in the mulching. No, nope. here he is. Right. Oh, he's got a couple of friends in there as well. There's a few there. So that's good to see that I've got some fungi in my soil as well as bacteria. I need the fungi to get to work on the clay so that it improves the soil consistency. Yeah, it's a long term plan but hey, nature's in no rush. So I'm going to keep amending the soil and hopefully I'll get much better soil condition in the coming years. Seem to have various weeds or flowers coming through. Just gonna leave them if they look half pretty. Anything that grows in with its roots will break up the clay and hopefully that will allow worms, bacteria and fungi and all the nematodes and all the rest of it, protozoa, to get in there and do their job and hopefully improve what is awful clay. Right, that's pretty much everything that I've got as an update. I've got a few leaf edges here probably burning off by cold or wind. I do get a bit of a breeze through which is good. I wouldn't want it stagnating in here. It's good to have some fresh air. I am suffering some leaf curl. Tends to be more further into the polytunnel. These last two beds. I suspect that's probably heat. Might just be the variety of potatoes. These are the supermarket leftovers. These four are shop bought seed potatoes. So don't really know what variety of potatoes these are but doesn't matter if I get a half decent crop. I've um, eaten a couple of strawberries. Got into them so quick I didn't even take a photo, let alone a, a video. So, here's one on its way. There's a few of them in there. I'd really like to get this 
into the ground so that they can spread a bit better and let their little roots run out and really get hold of all the nutrients they want. Probably do a quick water in before I head off home. It's looking a bit dry around the edges. I wonder how it's feeling on the inside. We go into here. Yeah, it wants to get nice and deep. Quite dark. Feels a little bit wet, not super wet. So I'd like to build them up so they don't dry out quite so much. I think being raised, they've got a tendency to let the water just slowly drain out and dry out a bit quicker than I would like. With all the mulch, it probably really helps keeping the moisture in for evaporation at least, so I've just got gravity to deal with. Got an onion here that's not faring too well, got brown tips, maybe that's heat again in here, no, never mind. This little strawberry here, she seems to be doing quite well. Throwing up more leaves. Might get a bit of a lake crop out of that one. This one over here seems to be getting established as well. Yep, you can see in there some nice new growth. So, it's good to see they're not dying. <laughs> they don't have to produce super well, it's pretty bad conditions or pretty nasty conditions for growing considering the soil and the heat, but I'm quite happy with what I've got. Right. I probably won't be doing so many updates quite so regularly, because now it's just a case of watch it grow. All I'm doing is extending back up here, and all that is just digging, and more digging. So, I'll probably not bother do so many updates just for now and I'll let you know once I've got further up there and I'm ready to start the work on this section right, looking forward to that but I think it's still going to be a little way off yet so bye for now